They've been the team to beat at this racetrack. William Sawalich, Connor Zilich, side by side. We get ready to go racing. We're green from the Milwaukee Mile. William Sawalich starting on the outside, nose to nose. Andres Perez, the point leader, outside, row number two. Wallace Allen with a great qualifying effort and a great start for him in that blue number 33. Yes, Walsh is able to grab that lead, get out in front of Zillich as they exit turn two. There's Gio Ruggiero get by his teammate, Dean Thompson. There's another teammate, Chris Wright in the 15th. It's been all about the 18 car. Three times, and caution is oh, out. No, Gio, Gio Ruggiero, the 20. Looks like the right front's down on that car. You see the splitter on the ground. Not sure if that's the cause or the effect there. Yeah, definitely a right front tire down. You can see it right there. I don't see any damage either, Trevor, unless I, the letters are still on that tire. You obviously must have run over something. So 97 laps to go at the line. You see the leader switch. Swallows taking the inside, took the outside on the initial start. He's going to try to get that leverage we talked about. Just be a fender ahead. Whoever can get that position getting into the corner. William Swalich has led every single lap. Lee starts on the inside. Connor Zilich on the outside. Wants to keep him in his sights. But look at Wallace Allen. He's been so good today. Look at him taking a peek in that blue car on the inside. Nice job by Swalich to get those right sides up in the grayer part of the racetrack. You see Zilich is able to slide in front of Wallace Allen off for turn two. See Lawless kind of gas up there in the center, try to close that gap, maybe pack some air on the 28. Wasn't able to get close enough to do that. Caution is out for the second time here at the Milwaukee Mile. Trouble for Tony Breidinger on lap number 67. See her right there, had issues in practice yesterday, got into the wall, couldn't qualify. It's working her way from the back to mid-pack, and she had this issue just moments ago while we were away. This is what you hear, see here, Phil. Right there, you see the 32 of Christian Rose and the 25 of Tony Breitinger. See, Christian just slides up and gets into the left rear quarter panel, and around she goes, she does a nice job keeping that car out of the wall. The 18 has gone to victory lane with three different drivers trying to make it four for four. Think back to a year ago, and this is where he had given up the lead to Jesse Love and had to fight back for it. So he wants to keep that clean air, get a good jump here. William Sawalich, Connor Zilich on the outside. Chris Wright, the 15 just behind him on the inside. Another great restart for William Sawalich. That 15 of Chris Wright working the bottom, challenging Connor Zilich right now. Zillich able to slide ahead of Chris Wright to hold on to that second spot. Andres Perez right there in the two. Seems to be getting better the longer this race goes as he takes a peek. William Sawalich with a 2.6 second lead over Connor Zillich. Chris Wright right there, Andres Perez, and there it is. The caution is out. This will be the break. Can Shane Huffman, crew chief of that 28 car, work his magic like we've seen him do so many times this year? So here we go. Second restart of the day. All right, here we go. William Sawalich on the inside, Connor Zilich outside. Chris Wright, Andres Perez behind him. More evenly matches, they head into turn one. A nice restart by Zilich. He's going to keep. Stays on his right rear quarter He's panel. He's there. He's there on that right rear quarter panel. This is the closest they have been all day. The momentum now by Zilich on the outside. He's going to pinch him down now that he has that fender lead. He controls the lane, and that's what Williams fighting back to do. If I can just get my fender in front, I can control it. Joe Gibbs Racing versus Pinnacle Racing Group side by side. These two teams have dominated this year, winning 10 of 14 races. That was full commitment right there by that 18 Full car. send. Full send down in the corner. 
he is. You see the white flag. You have one to go. And you can see on the left side of the screen, you see he's got almost a four-second lead over Zilich. But to show the domination of those two cars, you see right now third is 29 seconds behind Sawalich. William Sawalich last year set a new track record. This year in qualifying broke his own record. For the seventh time this season, William Sawalich crosses the line first. He gets it done at the Milwaukee Mile.